tell you what they have and what they don't have for eggs. See, so they got the ones like down here, but there's no price. Uh-huh. They got happy egg, organic egg. Some brown eggs. And over here, they have 60 egg boxes. See? But these are 2702 for 60 eggs. So that's all they have here at Walmart. Now this is the orange juice and like refrigerated juice aisle. And this is also empty pretty much. I guess they have fruit punch. They have a couple tropical punches up on top. I can't uh, reach the top ever. I'm very short. But I didn't come here to buy juice anyway. I just wanted to show you this. See, there's an area for cheese here. And a lot of it is gone. This is supposed to be Great Value brand, which is the store brand for Walmart. I mean, they're, they're pretty reasonable, right? But they're all not here. Right next to the orange juice is like where the coffee made and coffee cream are supposed to be. I say supposed to be, I mean, there are a few. There are a few. Not really though. Honestly, I don't understand why people are buying them at the price they are, but they are, or they didn't get them. Look, they got a whole bunch of milk behind them. I guess it just wasn't put out yet. And that's all milk back there. The crates and crates and crates of like gallons of whole milk is what it looks like. So this milk situation is definitely an issue where it's just not been shelved. It's not stocked, but it is behind the shelf because the shelves are empty. The milk shelves are basically empty, but if you go and look behind in the storage area, see? That's all milk back there in, in the crates. It just hasn't been put out yet, so it's not actually gone. It's just not, you know, it wasn't stocked yet. Hey, look, look, this is a six pack of 16.9 uh, fluid ounce bottles of Coca-Cola and there's only a one. Do you think they're a dollar? <laughs> because they don't have the actual price on here. There's a price here, but this is actually the price for these. So I'm wondering if the price is above. So then I look above and nope, because these prices are for these cans. Yeah, I'm going to show you this entire thing, okay? See? They have some monkey bread and some dinner rolls. And uh, a couple garlic breads. These butter croissants are really good, but they went up like a dollar and a half. These, these are great value. These are really, really good. They taste more like real croissants, but very expensive. These are breakfast sandwiches. some of these uh, Jimmy Dean breakfast bowls left $2.82 I guess for any variety it's a hungry man in there when it shouldn't be these are breakfast wraps this is the 
Great value brand uh, breakfast sandwiches and toast sticks. There's only like four or five of those left and there's only one of the turkey sausage kind and that's it. Over here too. See, there's pancakes, 246 and that's it. Up top, I can't even see what that is, I'm so short. These are waffles. And then these are the Eggo waffles. There's some on the top. Maybe everybody's just short like me and they could not reach them. There's Red Baron pizzas and stuff. This is just a bunch of random stuff here. None of this is supposed to be here. These are supposed to be waffles also. Look. Dragon green apple waffles. Ah! 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 ah. That's adorable. I'm not going to try them. <laughs> that is cute. That is cute. That's really cute. Yeah, a couple of chocolate chip Eggos hiding back there. But they're $5.98. How'd you get 24 of those? a bigger package. There's a couple pancakes. Buttermilk pancakes in a box, frozen, but you know, you can make pancakes. They're very easy to make. These are supposed to be toaster strudels and things like that. Yeah, there's a couple. Actually, those are toaster scrambles. And there's a pancake sandwich I've never seen before up there. <laughs> It's almost $7, however, and you only get four of them. I don't know if they're any good. I don't know. I've never tasted them. I've never tasted them. And the last one in this whole aisle is breakfast sausages frozen. Wow, are those expensive. They're very expensive. Wow, eight thirty-six dollars For maple flavored breakfast sausages, holy crap. Wow. There is a lot of bottled water in this store now. This was empty a couple weeks ago. There was nothing at all. This is purified water. Now, I like spring water. People use it to purify sterile medical equipment. I didn't know that. So I always kind of wondered why they always had purified water and like distilled water and things, but they didn't have the spring water too much lately. No, these are spring water. Spring water is better to drink, but I guess I can understand that with the distilled and the purified water. This is like all over the place. Like it's not even, you know, it's sticking out into the aisle. So I, I don't know. And some of them have been torn open. They do have um, the jugs or gallons or whatever of purified water also. 